factorization of algebraic expressions. So we have some three algebraic expressions here to factorize. We are beginning with the first one here. In the next video, we'll do this. Then in the one that follows, we'll solve the last one there. So we are going to use some identities. Recall that when we have something like this, x plus y all squared, it is equal to x squared plus 2xy plus y squared. Then we have, if we have x minus y all squared, this is equal to x squared minus 2xy plus y squared. So with 4x squared minus 8x plus 4, we can factor the highest common factor, which is 4, out. We are left with x squared. Then we are left with minus 2x here. Then we are left with plus 1. So we can better rewrite this well. We have x squared minus 2 times 1 times x plus 1 squared so it means this is 4 into brackets x minus x minus 1 all squared so that is the factorization of this expression you are seeing there so let's move to the next video where we are going to tackle this particular question